Okay, guys. So the final thing that I have for Etsy Hits and Misses is should do this like every year this has been really really fun i mean other than putting things in my um monthly favorites that type of thing this is really a fun video so i think that i may do this probably once a year or once every six months or so with the newer newer items so i have no items and the first two that i have to show you are the zoya and these are five free um so i know that they're formaldehyde twirling and then it's a couple of other camper and a bunch of things that it's free of these are beautiful colors this one is in giovanna and it's like a gem colored green it's pretty for the holidays it's almost a blue green it looks like a blue green on the screen but it is really a true emerald green shimmery color and this is um the color dot and it's just a really really pretty baby pink these are, um, I believe, 0.5 fluid ounces, and they are full size, and I believe that the Zoya nail polishes are $8 retail. So this, when you get one of these in your Ipsy bag, even if it's a color you don't like, if you want to try to sell it or try to swap it or gift it to someone, they actually do come boxed. But um, they pretty much almost pay for the bag for itself because it's $10. So those are really good. Those are a hit. The next one is a definite hit. I love this nail color. It is the Nail Teeny in Champagne. And that is a really almost a rose gold color. It has a long, long brush. I wish I could do swatches, but I'm, my nails are done right now. But yeah, definitely a hit. And then the last one is kind of a miss. Um, it is the Nicole by OPI, and it's actually a textured nail polish, and it says no top coat. And I found that when I did not wear a top coat with it, and I'll show you kind of what it looks like. When I did not, and it's a full size, so of course it's probably worth $8, and it's in the color on the grounds. Um, it was a very beautiful kind of speckled color, but I found that with my hair, even before I was trying to go natural, it was snagging my hair and kind of pulling my hair out. So I actually had to put a top coat over it and it still kind of gave that effect. And I found that it chipped like crazy. But anyway, it has like a normal brush. But it does. It has like little, it's almost like a sandpaper when you actually finish your nails. It feels like sandpaper. So it's textured. And I know that that was in for a while and everything. But this is a definite miss. So if anybody, um, I know that nail products, I think that you can give them away. Um, I think that those are pretty sanitary to give away. So, I would actually be willing to give these two away. Because I don't really wear this one a lot. I did kind of try it out for the formula, but I don't really use it. But if anybody is interested in either of these, or in both of these, let me know in the comments. And I will be more than happy to send it to you. Send me a private message, and I'll get them to you. So, anyways, you guys, that concludes all of my Ipsy Hits or misses or hits and misses i hope that everybody has a good friday and that everybody has a great great weekend and i will see you guys in the next video bye peace out